Now, Patrick, one of the things is you are always busy working. I mean, you just came off of doing your shooting Hollywood sp um, sporting clays, which yeah. is fabulous. Yeah, it was fun. It's yeah. really, we're, we're actually very big on teaching women how to shoot. you got to come out and go shooting with me. Uh, archery, too. We had championship women teaching archery, and uh, we fed 1,258 people Did this you? year. Oh my yeah. gosh, that's and, a lot of people. Uh, and you know, the food was really good. Yeah, we kind of, uh, that was champion barbecue and they did really great stuff. We raised money for a, an organization called Guide On, mm -hmm. which is services the orphans of and widows of men and women killed in Iraq and Afghanistan and the, the paralyzed veterans of America and, and uh, something called Gallant Few that ser services wounded warriors. Oh, that is so, awesome. um, yeah, it's a really, it's become a really great event. And, Colt and Glock and Smith and Wesson and a lot of great companies, American companies, have come in to support us and that's awesome and uh, help us to get it done. That's really awesome. Now, what about all your oh, movies? You know, you you know what? We went into partnership with the LA Film School. You did? Yeah, they became a uh, they became a partner with us and a sponsor. So we had two complete film crews from the LA Film School. There, uh, Amber Shahib, who handles you know uh, veterans, make up fifteen percent of their enrollment. So, yeah, and wow. since we're very pro-veteran and uh, we help uh, wounded warriors as much as we can. And so uh, they had two crews out there. I'm very excited about that because to get these young filmmakers going uh, with um, real knowledge about the shooting sports and the outdoor sports oh, yeah. is a really cool thing. Well, that's one of the things is what you do. People have a lot of fun, but it's also very educational and informative about mm -hmm. the, the, the sport itself. Well, isn't that life? you got to learn new skills. Mm -hmm. That's the glory of being an actor or a writer or a producer or whatever. You're, you're always learning new things. Yeah. You know, isn't that what life's all about? It is. Education, education, mm -hmm. and then you get Here off you the off. planet. <laughs> okay, now, you, before you, I know, he, look, he's getting anxious because he's been here a little no, bit. No, no, no. Huh. you got to tell us about your movies you're working on because you've been doing quite a few. You've been very busy. Well, yeah, it's the curse of a liberal arts education. Um, <laughs> I have a big movie that we're doing that takes place in the 1700s in Georgia. Yeah. <coughs> you know, Georgia's very film friendly, and we've been, yeah. I've been going down there for years uh, hunting quail. And um, so I'm sort of a favorite son down there. And so we set up a movie down there. In fact, we've got two set up, and then we have one in uh, New Mexico. Unfortunately, the people in California's legislature are not all that enlightened. And they're doing everything they can to destroy a once great business here. You know here. what? It's like, <coughs> um, unfortunately, I happen to agree with yeah. you. you know? They've done everything they can to drive films out of uh, Los Angeles yeah. and California. but um, We're hoping that will change soon. <coughs> well, it's going to take somebody with some real leadership uh, yeah. getting in there. And <coughs> in these times, it's tough for these people to think, okay, if we spend a buck on film production... Um, we don't have a buck, but those states that get it, you know, like New Mexico and Louisiana and, right. and uh, Georgia, they spend the money, but they know that they're getting three times back. Yeah. So it's an investment in the future, and it's an eco-sensitive business. Yeah. So it's really a great thing for people. Fortunately, the people in Georgia have seen the, the good side of it with Blindside and these other things, and New Mexico is very visionary. Yeah. <coughs> so well, I guess I know where you're doing your filming. <laughs> you know, uh, raising money for films is so challenging mm -hmm. that you, you and investors are so smart and they need to be serviced and they know that uh, what states provide, <coughs> excuse me, what locations provide is key to the whole investment package. Well, it is. So it makes a, big a location difference. like California, even though they put in this 25% lottery thing, it's not enough. You have yeah. to remain competitive. Yeah. So um, hopefully they'll change. Uh, when I run for governor, maybe you'll... Are, uh, are you really going to run? Well, somebody's got to. I mean, no, somebody no. really has to. Help this industry. To, well, you certainly... Uh, I'd help all industries. And oh, right now, okay. people in California <laughs> aren't being served. You've no, got not. You've got industries leaving in droves. Well, I so, look forward to seeing you run. I look forward to it as well. Ah, Patrick, thank Cheers. you very much. Always Bye. great to see you. Cheers. Cheers.